Hey everybody, welcome to Kimmel's Irish Pub. I wanted to scare her a little bit. Yep, big one tonight. You clicked on it so you already know. It's the Babushkas of Chernobyl. Is that how you say it? Chernobyl? I say Chernobyl. Chernobyl. But you could be Chernobyl. Anyway. Chernobyl. I don't know. Sure. Noble. Anyway, um, I'm always asking for requests. Uh, a friend, a subscriber, longtime listener, first time caller, Rich recommended this one so I have to do the duty and do a review on it even though it's a documentary um, so I'm gonna read to you what the description is um, an affectionate portrait of a group of women who after the 1986 Chernobyl disaster and evacuation returned to the exclusion zone um, surrounding the nuclear power plant and have resided there semi officially for years so Seems interesting. It's a documentary. I don't normally do documentaries. 8.0 on IMDb. Rotten Tomatoes 100% from the critics and 86% from the users. So Ooh. very highly rated. Wow. And, and why don't you tell them a little bit about the choices we have? Well, it's kind of a mystery because you can either go with the 52 minute version or the 72 minute. There's no explanations, even on the box, so we don't really know. We're just going for the 72 minutes. We're going 72 minutes. We go big or go home. I think it's going to be with bloopers. Oh, probably the gag reel. <laughs> right. Yeah, you definitely. Know, definitely. Um, so, so we're excited to get started, and as Joel mentioned, on a box, because we're going old school. Oh, yeah. This is one of those DVDs. The kids don't know about it. Uh-uh. Look at that. That. Mm -hmm. So, and if you haven't noticed, my hot wife's joining us tonight. You know, everybody's favorite co-star. Another <laughs> request. From all you subscribers. Another, but you're going to say another host. Another host. Like a, you had others besides me. Well, Bo. Besides Bo. Well, Bo. Yeah. Yeah. well obviously Bo. she's she's a, a fan favorite. Right. So anyway, we'll get into it a little bit here. And uh, if there's anything interesting, we'll do some check-ins. And if not, we'll see you at the credits. Anything to add before we check out? Nope. Can't wait. All right. Me neither. 72 minutes. We're going 72. Go big. <laughs> Go home. All right. See that? We're cool. <laughs> We're so cool. Sometimes we always finish each other's sentences, <laughs> sandwiches. <laughs> Sorry. That's all right. We'll be back in a little bit. <laughs> hey, everybody. We're at the credits of Babushka's of Chernobyl. Sorry, there was no um, check ins. Uh, the movie was rather short, as we said, only 72 minutes. And I think, real quick, if I could talk about that, I think the extra 20 minutes were about the stalkers. You know what they had to do with the TED Talk? No, the TED Talk was a different video. Oh. I also, uh, Rich also gave us uh, uh, the TED Talk to watch about it. That was oh, okay. something separate, so gotcha. you can learn a little bit more about it. And that was interesting as well. So if you watch this movie, check out the TED Talk. But the stalkers are a group of kids who play video games, who f jump over the fence, the barbed wire, to research in there and everything like that. It was, I don't know, off-putting for me. Um, but um, so that's I think the point. That, right. But before I you know, get into Joelle... And get your comments. Uh, it was very entertaining, very educational for me. Um, I think, you know, we started off with a lot of giggles and smiles, you know, watching these uh, babushkas, you know, fend for themselves, the way they interact with each other. They're very funny. But uh, turned to sniffles and tears uh, to see the hardship that they went through. Right? Right. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> anyway, so you were saying... <laughs> No, no, I, I just, I was pleasantly surprised. Um, but it, it's a, a reminder, a little bit of my grandmother, great grandmother. It's all of uh, my ethnic heritage, you know, and so a lot of things were very, like, hit close to home. But the one thing that really resonated with me was just this, these women's strength, the going through. Stalin and wars and famine and burying people when they're teenagers to living in a radioactive neighborhood because they try to get back to it. They were evicted. They came back because they wanted to be in their homeland. And they're just, they're, their closeness with one another is what makes them so happy. They continue to find joy in everything in the worst of circumstances where nobody would even set foot unless they're crazy playing video games and think it's a joke. But the, the, they even made a point in there, and I don't know if it's a spoiler about what the doctor said, but I, I thought that it was something that um, they tested and they found that the people that did uh, evacuate or leave the village um, died much younger than the women that stayed. 
and uh, it had a lot to do with their socio uh, backgrounds and, and their um, surroundings and and their relationships. They just have each other. It's it's a lot of women. There's very few men that live there. You know, I don't know how long this movie was made, but you know, how long ago it was moved? 2015. Yeah. Okay, so still, I mean, they're in their 80s. They're, right. they're, I mean, and they're doing so much more in a day than, like, I can't even imagine. Right. It's just so much. Week. Yeah, they oh. have, like, I think I have bad days. Like, I watched this and I just, I couldn't stop crying. It was just amazing. Right, and the, you touched on the people who they evacuated and never went back, dying of anguish. Yes, anguish, right. Uh, you know what I mean? And, and as she said, uh, they die much younger than the people who moved back in. So very powerful film about, you know, how these women really, and what they refer to it as the motherland. Right. You know, you think sure. about, I know we're not very similar, but a lot of people out there move many, many times. We're always, right. we've always lived where we've kind of lived in, a, in, not in the same house, but these no. people believe so much in the, the motherland, the soil that they're, they're, the houses that they're raised in, the, the mothers and the fathers and the graves are right down the road, that that's what they have to they get They die into. in the same house. Yeah. They, that's where they need to be. And the blue one, they would live a lot longer than a lot of other people. So, very powerful film, documentary, um, and educational. Fun for a little bit, sad for a little bit, but definitely worth it. What would you give it? A ten. A ten. I would. A ten. She gave it a ten. For a documentary, it's it really makes it kind of put life into perspective. I think. And only seventy-two minutes long, so I mean, it's not you know. Right. You're not. It's not too long. Right. It's not too short. I would probably, if if we were right, if the stalker piece is the extra 20 minutes, I would skip that and yeah. watch the 52 minutes, but Same. I don't know. So if anybody else knows, please put it in the comments below. Right. Right. <laughs> Down there. Oh. Right. <laughs> but anything else to add or we'll close it out? No, I think we're good. I'm, I'm just, I have to, you know. Yeah, she's a little teary, so her, her makeup run, but she still looks beautiful, right? You know, if you agree, hit the like Let's button. Touch. <laughs> <laughs> but um, you know, as usual, we'll we'll put in the bloopers. Um, this time, <laughs> instead of in the like button, we're gonna put it on the subscribe button. Uh -huh. If you hit the su subscribe button, you'll see all these crazy bloopers. So many. Where we messed up <laughs> all, all the, the time. Th oh. oh. <laughs> <laughs> all right, that's it. Thanks for tuning in, Kimmel's Irish Pub. Please let us know what you think. Bye. See ya.